There was talk of a July meeting between Ryan Garcia and Jorge Linares uh, before the shutdown. But now that that uh, things may be opening up and uh, Golden Boy is uh, and Golden Boy Promotions looks to be readying for their first show, and the headliner for their first show may be Ryan Garcia versus Jorge Linares. Now, at first glance, I was a little surprised that Golden Boy would match up Ryan Garcia with Linares uh, so early in his career, as this this would be a huge step up. I mean, Garcia has not fought anyone near Linares's talent, experience, or accomplishments. Uh, the, do, the two do have a common opponent in Carlos Morales. Uh, Linares dropped Morales twice and stopped him in the fourth round, but uh, Ryan Garcia struggled with him and got a majority uh, win decision. So, um, and it was one of those fights where you saw all of all of uh, Garcia's inexperience laid bare. He just threw the same combinations over and over, left, right, hooks, and he, he just went passive when his... Um, when Morales just didn't cooperate with him. So on the other side of the coin, um, taking a closer look at Linares' record, yeah, he may be the perfect stepping stone for Garcia, and I could see maybe where that's where where uh, Golden Boy Promotions is thinking. Um, Linares has been stopped by Lomachenko and Pablo Cano in the past two years. He's been hot and cold throughout his career, and... Um, even though I must say that his competitiveness against Lomachenko uh, came as a surprise. I remember he knocked Lomachenko down in the sixth round of their fight. And that fight was even on the scorecards going into the tenth round of their, their battle. So, um, you know, looking back at his career, Linares may be one of those fighters that just can't get up psychologically for uh, fighters that are just simply way beneath him, like, you know, Pablo Cano and Salgado. I'm looking at his record. There's a guy, Sergio Thompson. These are hard-hitting fighters, hard-hitting punchers that all knocked him out early, but uh, they have nondescript careers. I mean, all of them didn't count. All of them have not achieved, all of, all of them combined have not achieved what Linares has uh, achieved throughout his career. He just, he was a step above these guys, and they were huge upsets. So, um... This would be an intriguing matchup, and I hope it happens soon. And the result will be predicated on Linares' uh, ability to weather the early storm from Garcia and take him into deep water. Uh, if he can do that, uh, Linares could easily frustrate the young fighter and hand him his first L. So uh, we'll see if this fight takes place.